almost all of us have visited amusement parks in our life because everyone wants some scary and thrilling experience. If you love enjoying swings, then such amazing amusement parks will help you to decrease some stress and give you a way to escape your daily monotonous routine. So here are the 10 most unbelievable amusement park rides around the world that will put a smile on your face. Number 10, The Skyscreamer. You can guess this ride by its name as it speaks for itself, a skyscreamer. It is technically a ride that will make you scream at the top of your lungs as it takes you up to the sky. So if you have acrophobia and you want to challenge yourself or want to fight against your fear of heights, then this is a ride you're looking for. This ride can be found in two famous parks in the States. One is at Six Flags Over Texas with the name Texas Skyscreamer. And there's another one at the Six Flags Park in Massachusetts known as the New England Skyscreamer. These both rides are tall and have made a Guinness World Record for being the tallest swing carousel rides in the world. I know you may have a question about how these rides are thrilling enough as carousel swings aren't normally one you think of. But let me tell you that it isn't a reality what you see standing on the ground because trust me, when you're in the air 400 meters high and spinning at 35 miles per hour on such a skimpy chair, then you'll know this ride isn't child's play. Number 9. Koalkiri Body Plunge Now let's move on with a drop door body slide a ride that pitches riders down a 70 degree angle descent for 125 feet of high speed fun. And the riders then end up splashing the water into a pool at the foot of Krakatau. Yes, you have guessed it right. I'm talking about the Kokiri Body Plunge. The fun fact about it is this ride is located at the volcano. And believe me, it isn't the scariest part. The actual fun about it is that it's nearly a vertical drop. This Koogiri body plunge ride only takes less than five seconds to get from the top of the slide to meet the final stop. In fact, you can call this ride one of the best adrenaline rushes in Orlando. If you can't stand big heights or are not a big fan of it, then this ride isn't for you. But if you're planning to conquer a big ride, then what are you waiting for? Try this one out. Since one person can enjoy this ride at a time, therefore, this ride is also known for the longest wait time among all the swings at Volcano Bay. Number 8. Giant Canyon Swing If you are a swing lover and you want to enjoy some extreme rides, then there's a pendulum ride known as Giant Canyon Swing that moves up to four passengers back and forth. That makes it look the most extreme, longest, and intense ride. You really want to enjoy it once in your lifetime. And if you're like one of those people, like me, who loves swings, especially the ones that are so high in the air, hoping to touch the sky with open arms, then this ride seems to be the one for you. As this ride sets itself into an almost vertical position, you can challenge the laws of physics because at some point, this ride could be swinging at a high speed of 50 miles per hour. I know you may have seen some similar rides like this one, but trust me guys, you can't find such a life thrilling ride except in places like Colorado. Number seven, X2. X2, an amazing and exciting roller coaster. Well, what else can you expect from a roller coaster ride that has the name X2? Not so much except fear, right? <laughs> but if the roller coaster is known as the world's fourth dimensional coaster, then what? I mean, just imagine that you're on a regular, normal roller coaster and boom, your seat starts twisting, turning at the same time. It is basically what we call X2, a fourth dimensional roller coaster, as it can give you a lifetime experience unlike any other ride. While the roller coaster came across the hills and started dropping, going through inversions, and your seat starts changing its directions on its own just to coincide with its track in most of the unexpected ways. 
To make one of the most expensive roller coasters on the planet, an X2 ride cost $45 million. It is the most expensive ride that Aerodynamics ever built that caused the company to go bankrupt. Number 6. Vanish What else can you expect from a word vanish? The act of disappearing. Seemingly, maybe, disappearing into thin air. Well, in Japan, a roller coaster is called Vanish, as this ride vanishes into thin air. No, no, don't take this as a joke, buddies. This particular roller coaster is also known as Diving Coaster Vanish. It has a pink track, it's 35 meters tall, and its signature element is a steep, curving drop into the water. Its design is quite impressive in regards to its land use, as it has a final break that runs under the lift hill and its layout goes around the whole theme park. That gives riders a view of other swings, if they're able to open their eyes, obviously. It has curves on the way down, it's quite steep, and after some time, the coaster disappears inside the floor. Once the diving coaster vanish approaches the water, water spouts spray water around the hole with the help of a sensor that detects it. The riders experience a tunnel covered in whirly lights underwater. What a beautiful experience, isn't it? If you ever want to know what it feels like when water swallows you up and actually want to enjoy it, then this is the coaster to ride on. Number 5. Insano Brazil. A place of loud carnivals, a place of lots of colors, and a place that has exotic and breathtaking landscapes. But for your knowledge, today we are surprisingly going to discuss something else about Brazil that will definitely make you go wow! Brazil is known as another home to Insano. It is nothing but one of the tallest water slides in the world. Yes, the world! In fact, when it was built in the late 80s, it immediately started being considered the tallest and fastest ride. There's a fun fact about it, actually. It holds an official Guinness World Record Award. So, aren't you excited to be on this insane kind of ride? Insano! Number 4. Nothing But Net Nothing But Net is definitely a bad option for the people who have acrophobia. So, just get away before you step in. This amusement theme park in Texas was founded in 1992. Its single goal was to be known as the most extreme amusement park in the world, and it's a success. Including the Nothing But Net Freefall Ride, which is the park's most insane ride, this park boasts five high-intensity thrill rides. This ride is a 16-story freefall. Riders are lifted to just below the top of the 16-story tower, and then simply let go with no parachute, no straps, and no bungee just a rider to enjoy the 130-foot drop and vibes. <laughs> to begin the rider's freefall, a staff member activates the release system. As this extreme freefall has no attachments, that's why participants drop into the suspended catch air device. Around the double net, there's brake suspensions and air tubes that stop the fall so softly that leave not any impact at all. So, riders feel the result of a very intense freefall experience. Number 3. Formula Rosa Formula Rosa was opened to the public in 2010. It has the maximum speed of a Ferrari and has a train that was designed as the car's model. No other coaster in the world can compete with Formula Rosa when it comes to speed. While its track itself doesn't come with any inversions, as the ride clocks in at an astounding 240 miles per hour, making this ride the fastest coaster in the world. No wonder, before strapping in this ride, guests are advised to wear safety goggles. It sets the riders into motion from 0 to 150 miles per hour in just 5 seconds. The track swerves around 1.5 miles of track and sits on a Ferrari racing course. This ride lasts 90 seconds, but it's one of the most heart-pounding seconds you can ever experience on a roller coaster. If you have never gotten a chance to sit in a Ferrari, then this roller coaster will give you that experience for sure. 
Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. And now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows? We might even feature it in one of our videos. This picture is fake shit. That has been created on the internet to attract viewers' attention, I guess. Because it is totally impossible for a ride to land in such a way as it can't fall on the track accurately. Because gravity is a boss, and it has its own rules. There's a video as well regarding this picture, but I don't want you to believe blindly on such fake facts. Number 1. Cannonball Loop There's another slide from Action Park that will make your jaw drop at the absurdity to complete our list. Even the park's safe rides can be responsible for countless bruises and scrapes. But there was one slide that was too dangerous, and that is none other than the infamous gravity-defying cannonball loop. This water slide has been abandoned like a drainage pipe because it has flipped the laws of physics so badly that it was open for a single summer. And the interesting part about it? The few people who actually went on this water slide were the Action Park employees, and they were given a hundred bucks just for trying the ride. So, which rides are you brave enough to try? Let us know by commenting down below. Thanks for watching.